Scott Dorval with your Idaho News 6 forecast. Good evening again, everyone. It is turning out to be a pretty nice evening. A little bit of a breeze, but the sun is shining. No thunderstorms today. A beautiful view of downtown Boise from the Grove Hotel looking right out over the Grove. Trees, uh, all the leaves getting mature now, and so the spring leaves are disappearing, and we're getting some full foliage going on. And a lot of people outside enjoying themselves today with 76 degrees. What a beautiful day. There's that northwest breeze at 15. I think it's going to go down to almost in half of what we had today. Maybe not quite half, but it'll be less breezy tomorrow, certainly at this time. Uh, and again, more sunshine is likely. So beautiful evening out there. Uh, high pressure is to the west of us. This is the trough that came through that gave some, well, one that gave us the storms yesterday is actually off the picture. This one came through last night and has been bringing some storms, a vigorous system as it's digging into the northern Rockies, as we say. Breezy conditions coming in behind it. That's why we've had a little bit of a, that cool the weather's kind of sneaking down from Canada and dropping our temperature just a few degrees. But that warmth has just been kind of pushed to the southwest for a little while. And then tomorrow it starts to move back in. And on Thursday it will surge in from west to east. And our temperatures are going to climb. And it will be the hottest day of the week. I'll call it hottest because we'll be mid to even upper 80s, close to 90 degrees again in Ontario during the day on Thursday. So here's what we've had since midnight. 76 in Boise, 78 in Yakima. We fast forward to the day tomorrow. Yakimar's going to 85 degrees. Boise up to 78. So a couple of degrees, two, three degrees warmer tomorrow throughout Idaho. And that warmer weather will be sliding to the east and temperatures warming more significantly to the west. That will come in during the day on Thursday. And there are none of those little troughs coming through. And so we're going to keep a lot of sunshine. Some of these high clouds will be drifting by from time to time with the jet stream nearby. And we still have a little bit of a breeze. We don't have a big H, big high pressure sitting right overhead to give us calm conditions. So we're still going to have breezes from time to time. But I'm still going to give it a 9 out of 10 tomorrow because of those beautiful temperatures, 78 degrees and sunshine. Uh, sunshine throughout the day. Wind northwest 5 to 10, not bad at all. Pollen counts on the extreme category. We're going to find out more about that coming up at 6 o'clock. It's mostly pine pollen, but this is a good looking Scott score. This is a good time of year for the nines and maybe even a couple of tens in there. So some kayaks out here. There, there they are right there in Payette Lake and a couple more boats coming into the marina. So uh, great news here as temperatures begin to warm up. We're into the mid 60s. Blue sky 68 tomorrow. Warmest day of the week will be Thursday at 71 from McCall and all throughout Long Valley, but look at the change. Thursday night, a cold front comes through. That means winds will be coming in north northwest right off Payette Lake for the day on Friday. It'll be breezy and uh, sharply cooler. We'll call it at least 12 degrees cooler upper 50s, and that's the way it's going to stay through the weekend, maybe even mid 50s. And the weekend forecast is still a little bit uncertain, but you remember yesterday I showed you this warm air coming in on Thursday, and this system was going to go by to the north, but look at this di diving further to the south. Computer charts are bringing the cooler air a little bit more overhead. So Saturday and Sunday will be cooler. Showers will probably stay north of the Salmon River, but we do have a bit of a cooling trend coming in that will probably stick with us through next week. So here's tomorrow. Low 80s in the Western Valley, sunshine, warmer conditions, a really, really nice day tomorrow. If you work outside or if you're just going to recreate outside, just picture perfect weather coming up tomorrow. 82 in Riggins, close to 70 in Long Valley tomorrow. Idaho City will be 76. Cambridge at uh, 79 degrees tomorrow. We look at the extended forecast. There's that warmest day on Thursday at 85, so I dropped my Scott score to an 8. Breezy on Friday as the front comes through Thursday night. And look at the temperatures over the weekend. We're going to drop those temperatures to, to between 70 and 73 and that goes in to next week.